What's up, nerd fans? Welcome back to Non Lethal Plays Talisman Digital Edition. We are sitting on the Crown of Command. We've been here for 20 minutes or more, just wailing on these guys. The thief keeps on bouncing back to the healer to get healed. Oh my gosh. And um, the dwarf is sort of sauntering around getting healed as well, so we're not really making a lot of progress. So we just have to keep on going and hoping that we eventually wear them down but even if we don't what we're going to do is assume that we won because otherwise it's going to be hours and hours of going oh this is dull and none of you guys want that none but do we still have a spell we do command Uh, nope. Okay. So we can cast it maybe ten times in this video before we run out of time, so... Let's, um, just... Oh, seriously? Let's just keep going and see how we fare. But the thief is good enough now that he can come and challenge me. And I welcome him to. I want him to. And the dwarf now is a talisman. Can't take the holy lands because evil. Really, you're dropping. Yeah, alchemizing a sword. You got two helmets. What the hell is wrong with the AI? Come on, command spell. Ten or fifteen casts. This will get so. All right, success. And I hope that the thief goes to the knight, but he won't. He'll go get some free strike. If he keeps doing that, then he's going to be able to challenge me. And that will not stand. And you're going to get healed at the castle for free. Uh, crikey malarkey. At least their turns were fast, so we get to cast this more often. Oh, man. Naturally goes there, gets healed, gets free craft. But now that craft stream is gone, but he's still going to bounce back to the strength stream and the healer every turn. The scary thing is, he can actually challenge me now if he wanted to. Just, he's not going to challenge me. Because he's a scaredy scaredy AI. Ugh. That um wants to get all the bonuses and never get rid of his poltergeist. See, once you get into the inner region, you can only move one space anyway, so the poltergeist isn't really a big deal. He just needs to go to the entrance, get in, and then he can wander around. And another talisman. Okay. Alchemizer Helmet. It's only three cards in the adventure deck and then they get reshuffled. Come on, command spell. No. Ooh. He's gone away. Maybe this means that I won't... I can cast it on him twice before he goes back and heals, yay. Ooh, what you doing? What you doing? Targeting the thief. You're stealing a follower. Ah ha ha! He's taking the mule, which will get rid of his carrying capacity, which means he'll lose several of his items. <laughs> Discard a helmet. Discard. I think he has to discard three more things. A water bottle, which is great because I want him to walk into the desert. This helmet, okay, cool. And one more. An axe, okay. Right, that was very entertaining. Now, 
fight him. Yes! Yes! Oh dear. Reroll it, dwarf. Yeah, hurt him. Put on the hurt. Yes. Ah, you saved the word. You probably would have been better off stealing the armor because then every turn you take some um, better chance of hurting. Counter spell. Really, dwarf? Really? You stole my wand and they're using it against me. I'm just going to go ahead and unqueue our spell because we don't need to have it queued for the time being. Strength points. The thief has actually got some scary stats down. 9 strength, 11 craft. And he's got armor and stuff as well. Sure, he lost 4 items, but he's still got a bunch of good items. Dun, dun. Counter spell again. How do you get two counter spells in a row, dwarf? Irritating to say the least. Oh, don't, don't, don't try to take all your stuff. Ooh, what you doing? Ah. <laughs> oh man, if he loses all his craft, he rolls a three. That would be quite good. Oop, gain a life. <laughs> okay. That does not help me. I'm just going to cycle through all these freaking objects. You drop them on the ground for a reason, just leave them there. This is the bad thing about the AI, it just cycles through items that are on the ground. You just dropped these here because you couldn't carry them. You're not going to take them again. Just leave them on the ground. Eh. Okay, now the dwarf... Okay. If at first you don't succeed, do it again. Ooh, gain a strength. Yeah, you just made him more powerful, gave him a life, and then gave him a strength. You're a good buddy. Thief, you need to ignore everything and just come and make a run at me. Where are you going? Dwarf! And we fail. Maybe that means a thief will move. No, he's not. <laughs> oh dear, drop the amulet. No, oh, okay, drop your armor, that works. Okay, so 11, 11 in his stats. That is a little bit ridiculous. The dwarf is spending all his fate moving around the board for some reason. We're just sitting here struggling with the crown of command. Yay, success. Which are uh, the thief is immediately going to heal back, but the dwarf cannot. Ooh, he's not there. Uh, uh, uh. On the plus side, maybe he'll be distracted by all these items and we can use this time to actually kill him. That would make me happy. <laughs> I don't know why you even go into that space, because the AI thinks, oh, there's items on the ground, I better go grab them. <laughs> there's only two cards left in the deck. Oh, well. 
At least he knows what those two are. Hag. No, we haven't seen the hag yet. The hag is a follower which gets rid of all of your other followers. And what happens is, uh, so he's just lost his um, mule. You have to get rid of the hag by going to the mystic in the village down the bottom right of the board. So kind of a bit of a karma for getting rid of the mule from the, from the thief. Alright, we're halfway through this episode and we're not really any closer to killing off either of these characters. Take and drop. I would get rid of the potion of strength. You've got a strength of 11. No one's even close to coming near you. So he's beelining to the village. Constructor. So he's increased his strength to miss a turn, cost of three gold. Command. Command. Yay, command. Both down to three lives. Thief can just heal, but dwarf cannot. But the thief isn't healing. So maybe my plan is working, maybe he's just going to cycle through all these items every turn. It's going to make for a dull watch, but I'll win. and I win the game. Come on. Oh, the thief's stats changed. What changed? What happened? I wasn't really paying attention, to be honest. Did he switch which items he was carrying? Seems like he must have. Yeah, he is. Interesting. So he's not doing the same thing every turn, which is questionable. Command ye to die. Nope. I need another string of good luck. Three successful casts in a row will do it for me. village get rid of your hag see the mist no not the healer you dumb shit go to the mystic uh, 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 uh. wow all right cast successfully so we've cast this enough times to actually kill these characters they just keep on coming back. I wonder if we'll go to the healer next turn or not. Success, which means the thief is only on one life, which means if he doesn't go to the healer, we can possibly kill him next turn. All right, this is exciting. <gasps> We've got two chances now to kill him. Hmm. 
Hopefully we can kill the thief. And we might actually do another legitimate episode where we attempt to kill the dwarf. Do, 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 do. Come on, thief. Your time has come. My one challenger. Thus endeth the reign of the thief. Now the turns will go much faster again as we just have to do with the dwarf. Cane gold, yeah. How much we care about the gold you gain? Oh, you've only got two lives left. This might be quicker than we thought. Guys, we can do it. One more. No, don't go to the healer. He's going to heal three lives. <laughs> oh, oh squibby dwarf. That just irritates me to no end. gonna have to come and challenge me sometime. You can't win the game like this. That'll let that one gold will let him heal one life. So as long as he's out of gold, it's not so bad. That dragon that we tuss tussled with many times earlier is still there. Come on episode. We'll keep this going. Quiet puppies who are barking in the background. Oh, I can purchase stuff. I've got one gold. None of the things are things I can use. So, whatever. Command. I can feel it, people. We are close. We are so close. It's down to two lives remaining. Come on, dwarf. Portal? Teleport? Planes of... Oh, so he's in the inner circle now. So he might actually make his way up and through. But he probably won't. He's probably going to move out and then try and go to the castle to get healed. Because screw that jerk and all he stands for. And... Hold it. Come on. Aha! Down to your last life. One more turn. Unless he rolls a one. Yes! Take the sword. Don't take the sword. Drop one of your two talismans and keep the sword. Seriously. AI. Come on, this could be it. This could be the final turn, guys. You're just in time. No. Alright, alright. We got this. Next turn. I'm gonna keep this episode going until this friggin' dwarf dies unless he somehow manages to heal. Come on, come on, come on. I don't know how many times we cast this command spell, but it will all be worth it. Uh, yes! Victory is ours, friends. Took us a while, but we got there. The lethal the monk is the commander with the crown. Yeah! Dun, dun, dun. We were the winner. Hey, we've earned runestones. 
Mm -hmm. That one. That one is what I want. All right, so we only got winner. We didn't get any of the other things. You can like um do other things like deliver the hag, uh, steal people with mesmerism, kill other players, spend lots of money, and you get more progress towards achievements. But um, we only got the winner, which put us up to level three. So that's it, guys. Talisman Digital Edition. It's a lot of fun. It's very addictive. I've been playing it a lot. So make sure you like this video and go check it out on Steam. Um, I'll put a, uh, a link on Twitter for it. So you can follow me on Twitter at nonlethalgaming and also at nerds at night. Make sure you subscribe to this channel to see all of our future gaming goodness. Share it out on your social media jazzes. Comment in the doobly-doo down below to let me know what you thought of the video. And as always, I've been Nonlethal and thank you for watching.